Hi everyone with Kelvin here. So let's discuss about weekly contest 177. Third question, number of operation to make network connected. So um, the question will specify us the number of computers and also there is another array to specify the connection. So the connections here itself um, have um, two, comp uh, two number um, in each of the array. So it's a two dimensional array. Each of the element have two, com um, two computer specified so here it means um, computer 1 com uh, and computer 0 is connected computer 0 and con computer 2 is connected and computer 1 and computer 2 is connected and the one that is not specified here since they said there is four computer so computer 3 never connected to any network and there is one extra cable uh, between the computer 0 1 and 2 that can be moved to connect to computer 3 so uh, in that case, um, we can do one operation to move the cable to connect either from 2 to 3 or 1 to 3 or 0 to 3 by removing one of the edges there. And see the second example also. Um, we need two operations to merge all the computers together. And when there is not, not enough cable um, to reuse to connect all the network, we should return a minus 1. And when it's all connected, then yeah, it will return a 0. So, how do we solve this question? So, this question is um, a typical um, disjoint union set operation. So, basically, we only need to perform union find to find out how many separated groups and how many extra cables are there. So, um, by extra cables, um, we can know how, how we can know that is an extra cables or not. Uh, we can know it by if it's already in the same group. So, let's say zero and two and zero and one is already connected when we want to connect one and two we know one is at group uh, on certain group and two is on certain group so if the group is the same then that means that cable is an extra so we store that cable in our counter to see how many extra cable do we have and if they are from different group then we merge it together let's say zero and two and then zero and three um, it would be two separate group and when we connect 0 to 1 um, both of them will be merged into one group by using a union find operation so let's see the code itself so this is the general code of the disjoint union set um, I specify n and um, yeah we will specify each of them um, as its parent and then when we want to connect so I look through every connection we have so if they haven't merged into one group yet, and uh, we, we will merge them. But if they are already merged together, then it will be a false means um, it's not go it's not performing any merge. So at that case, I return a false means they are in the same group. It means we have extra connection to make. And at the end, we figure out how many unique group we have and determine whether we have enough cable to connect them all or not if we don't have enough cable to connect them all we should return a minus one otherwise mm. we should um, merge all the group together by the number of group minus one so that's it for this question thank you for watching see you on the next weekly contest